Maybe you've heard the saying, budgets are moral documents. And that's true. Oh no, I tried a budget once, didn't work. So why are we still operating under a Trump era budget even though President Biden has been in office for over 400 days? To understand how we got here, let's take a look at two key terms, appropriations and continuing resolutions. When Congress passes a budget, also called appropriations, they're in a sense laying out the moral priorities for the nation and appropriating the money to fund them. That's why there are such vigorous debates over questions like, should we really be spending so much on the military? Shouldn't we be increasing funding for social programs, healthcare, and other services millions of people rely on? And unlike most other countries, when Congress can't cut a deal, they risk a government shutdown. Usually, Congress finds a way to extend time for debate without going into a shutdown. They do this by agreeing to a continuing resolution, or CR for short. Members of the two opposing political parties trying to straighten out some difference of opinion so that lawmaking will not be blocked. However, when many short-term CRs are passed in succession, or when a long-term CR is passed in place of a new appropriations bill, government funds aren't being updated to meet current needs or to keep up with inflation. More continuing resolutions that extend Trump-era budgets won't cut it. Congress has the opportunity to pass a budget that meets the needs of our communities, 